to import ship files or raster files, vector files into your QGIS software application, you can easily do this on your data source manager tool. You click on this. If you do not see it on your toolbar here, then right click here and under tools, on your toolbar, you'll see data source manager. Make sure that it is checked out here. So to import vector files, vector files are editable files made up of points, lines, and polygons, like shape files, geo package, geo database, anything, your card files, all are vector files. Well, raster files are images, satellite images. You have your PNG, GPG, JPG, and what have you. So click on vector here, file, and Click on this source to navigate to the saves directory. Remember, we're working with vector right now, so let's try importing the shape file. I'll just go to where I have mine saved. PGIS Special Data Hub. If you are watching any of my videos for the first time, then welcome on board. Do well to subscribe to the channel as I provide very helpful tips for your GIS analysis. When you're downloading this, click on add. The time difference that it takes for this process to complete largely depends on the size of the file. Yeah, so once you're done with that, you click on close and you see the shape file added to our background here, our workspace. To add raster data, the difference here is just you click on raster and navigates to the directory. That's the whole difference.